All right, you guys, on this next thing I got coming up real soon. I think I'm gonna ride the, I'm gonna ride the full wing. What y'all think? Woo! Woo! I took the box that I love, the 45 liter box that holds one full size helmet off of the F6B. Fixing to put a tire on him. It did flawlessly going to Daytona. Took the box off him, stuck it on the full gold wing, and I think I'm gonna do a hundred. I'm gonna complete the hundred thousand miles on this bike. I'm gonna go ahead and trip that dog on the uh, 100,000 mile meter on that uh, full wing I call the Go Getter. And uh, we may put it up for sale after that. I, I think I feel like I did good by putting 100,000 miles on this one bike. And uh, anyway, but when I do this, when I'm going no trailer, I'm gonna be moving very quickly because I don't, I'm not retired yet, and I'm not waiting to retire before I enjoy life. And I'm going to uh, rock it out, y'all. I'm already packed. If you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. But that's not the reason why I'm doing this video. The reason why I'm doing this video is when I go out there, uh, weather permitting, because it's going to be in April, I'm not gonna be hunting down no hotel rooms. That's why I'm not really telling a lot of people because I don't wanna deal with the I don't wanna deal with that. I ain't gonna deal with it. So uh if I get sleepy at night, I may pull over to a rest area, truck stop, hospital, somewhere, and I'm just gonna grab me a cowboy camp, a cowboy nap. And uh I'll show you my setup and how it's in my bike right now with no trailer like I said there's the box everything that's going into the hotel is in this Sadichi waterproof bag and I have my karaoke bag back here and back here let's give you an eyeball of what's A camping bowl. I have a pillow. I have a footprint that I will lay down on it. Here is my camping uh, quilt, my sleeping quilt. I have a cup. My bug hat. And uh, camping washcloths and stuff like that. So... That's what's up top. It's lightweight. I know first thing to say, don't put too much weight up here, Slappy. I do know that. Probably about, I think it's everything in this bag is about 25 pounds, 15 pounds. But what I have in here is the key. Yeah, Mr. No Shoulders. I have my shoes and that gold thing is my sleeping pad.
I'm gonna fit, I'm gonna uh, show you a a video of how I treated everything and got it bug repellent on it and got it uh water repellent. And I'm only going to cowboy camp if it's good weather. I'm not gonna do it if it's raining or a threat of chance of rain. I do have a tarp that I could put, hook it here, hook it on the handlebars to make a lean to. You feel understand what I'm saying? Make a lean to where I can lay down beside the bike and get up under it. But if there's any rain to forecast, I'll be in the hotel. Uh, check this video out. Hey, hit me, boy, after like this video. Subscribe to that bad boy. Don't forget to personalize it. <laughs> me and Thumper is getting our camping equipment ready for whatever. Um, I'm Thumper. I am... Getting ready for our big, well, I'm going on the Appalachian Trail, you guys, in a couple weeks. So, we have all this gear out here. It's getting sprayed down. You guys use your perithium, getting it all ready. Uh, Slack has got his, his, his pad, but he's going to be doing some camping. So, that is our go for today, is to get everything sprayed down, ready to go. And, hey, we got this thing going. Now, what's the reason why we're spraying this down there? Thing you can do is like lay down on the ground and you wake up with a bunch of ticks on your clothes and stuff. So this actually helps you, protects you from that. So she's getting ready to get ready to walk as far as she can in about what a month or two on the Appalachian Trail. Mm -hmm. So she's getting her equipment. This is a tent, one man tent. tent, one person tent, getting it sprayed down. This is my sleeping pad. I plan on doing some cowboy camping on a uh, trip that I got coming up. And if I get sleepy, tired, or whatever, y'all see me sleep in the Harley Davidson dealership just on the grass. But I'm going to lay that mat down, take me a couple of hours of sleep, and keep it moving. After that dries a little bit, we're going to attempt to uh, spray some camp dry on the materials that we want to keep uh rain suits and bags and whatever help keep it dry kind of like rain eggs for your clothes Lot or whatever. I'll just lay that footprint down just to give me a little barrier from the moisture on the ground. Then I lay that uh, sleeping pad down. And uh, that's what it's going to look like. And lay down there for a few hours. And that's kind of how we're going to do this, y'all. Uh, do a little cowboy camping. Not every day. Just when we need to. And keep it moving. Give my old trailer a break on this trip. But she is ready. If you stay ready, you don't have to get ready, y'all. Remember that. If you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. If you're new to the channel, I appreciate you hitting that thumbs up, subscribing. I got some good things finna go on, y'all. I'm finna put 100,000 miles on this bike. And we may have it for sale after that and get something else. Come on. Thanks for watching another episode of Slappy Adventures. Please like, share, and comment. And don't
don't forget to hit the subscribe button. <laughs> hey, stay tuned for more videos like this.